Oz, the HBO series Oz. Oh yeah. Where um, what's his name from Spider Man? The from uh, BC from the Daily Bugle. Is that his name? No, uh, no, that's the black guy. No, no, I'm talking about the white, uh, the AB, the Aryan Brotherhood guy, the leader of it. He was a, but he's an actor, and he's from. He was in the Spider Man movies. He comes out in oh, the insurance. Oh yeah, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, and he tells the guy with the glasses. Remember the guy with the glasses that was kind of like the bitch of the the, the gang, or whatever in prison. He sure. was like, he was like, hey, get your towel. We're gonna take a shower. He's like, I just took a shower. He's like, I don't give a fuck what the hell you just took. Get your ass in and get in the shower, like. Like, you know what I want? He was just like, mm, and he grabbed his towel, and I was like, fuck. <laughs> I was like, I'll never watch this show. <laughs> God damn it, dude. He's on the regular? It's too hardcore, man. Why? There was no reason. I don't yeah, know why people no like to watch that. that shit, dude. It's just, it's weird. Well, they didn't show it. Show it Wasn't they? it popular? How many seasons them, did it? Uh, it was a lot, dude. How many seasons did Oz, Oz, Oz go? I don't know. Too many, bro. I have no idea. I know it was popular. I mean, I yeah, still but know. Yeah, but it was. I thought, the, I thought the I thought the butt fucking was insinuated, not. Mm-mm. No, no, there's, no, there's, there's. It's that was scenes. HBO, bro. Soft core. They showed the two, the the four legs on the bottom and calf straining down. And you're like, ah. You'll hear clapping in Some, HBO. A little bit of clapping. Series. Yeah. I mean, not, not the. Uh, not Oz. I don't know. I don't. Remember. I don't remember seeing Oz like. I, didn't I remember it. seeing the feet and the calves like straining. I was like, I'm done with this, dude. I'll never. See you didn't this. fast forward it, or I'm not gonna fast forward it. There's he nothing. Rewound. There's no. He rewound, rewound it. it. <laughs> there's no I reward rewound at the it. end of that shit. <laughs> what is I it forgot about? they got those dirty movies though. I saw a, a dirty movie, uh, or just parts of it on uh, the HBO app. And yeah. I was like, oh yeah, they do have these after dark bullshit. So I they fucking suck though. They're terrible, dude. Yeah. They're terrible. This is one. It's called uh, um, uh, Sluts in the OR or some shit like that. It's about these. Or ER. And it's like doctors or nurses in the ER, OR. I don't know. And <clears throat> this one guy, he's in a Hawaiian shirt. And he's just getting a blowjob. And he's all like, ah, like that. And they show the girl's back of her head doing this. But they never show anything. Nothing. I was yeah. just like, ah, that's right. It's like Japanese pornography where they blur it out. Did you ever see Real Sex? Hell yeah, I watch all that <laughs> shit, dude. Hell yeah. But real sex was more of just education. Yeah, mm. it was kind of like a freak show. Was sharing yeah, dirty it, stories. It was that shit. too, but I'm saying though, it wasn't a thing like, all right, now it's time to jerk off. No, it was like, yeah, we had a threesome, and the guy's like, yeah, it was pretty good. And then this this girl's like as big as a house, and he's like a skinny tooth big guy, and then they have a girl come over and. They show the girl going down on the girl, but they don't show it, show it. They just show the girl's head between the legs. And she's like, oh, and the guy's like in the corner going, yeah, you like that? And I'm like fucking 13. I'm like, yeah, you like that? <laughs> yeah, that's the only time you can watch Thinking you see, about uh, it, it's what about like, this is goofy, bro, huh? Hookers at the point? Hookers at the point, yeah. That one hooker who, uh, she got her teeth knocked out. Did you see that one? Uh, No, I don't remember that. She's in the back of the car. And she's like negotiating with the guy. He's like, "All right, I got thirty for anal." She's like, "Honey, my asshole's worth more than that." Like, but the camera's outside of the car, and she's just mic'd up. And you see them talking like through the back windshield and shit. I don't remember that. You don't remember that one? No. Do, do you remember one, the one where the guy was like, uh, he was like trying to get a blowjob for like twenty bucks, and he's like, "I bet you I can do it tonight." And so they follow him around. He, he finds this girl. He's like, "All right." He told her he had a hundred. She's like, "All right, like I'll suck your dick. Put this shit down." He's like, so he starts sucking his dick, and then her phone rings. And she's all like, girl, hold on a second. I'm, man, here I am talking to you, and I got a dick in my mouth. Hold up. And hangs up and starts blowing. And he's like, yeah, hurry, hurry. Yeah, you like that shit? I, I, I'm, I'm going to come in your mouth. And she's like, man, hurry up. And then he goes, man, I only got 20 for you, though. He's like, you a broke ass nigga. Give me that motherfucking takes the money. And then it comes out later that he was HIV positive the whole time or some shit. And I was like, God damn, right. dude. And he was like addicted to it. He's like, Did he go to I prison? can't help it. No, it's just, I mean, I hope so. I don't know. Fuck. If, if you think about it, so if, if they go through a thousand Johns yeah. and it's an average of $50, <laughs> dollars, mm-hmm. you know, that's only $50,000 for work. Only? Tax free though? Yeah, but no, no, it's not tax that free because you're, you're, you're and you're, back then fifty thousand. You're gonna have it's to. Like she's seventy five, bro. That's and like, she, I don't know more she's than double. Play, you know? She's having to give something to her pimp as well. Damn, that's I don't, even know, I don't even know. she had a pimp. I don't well, even know, you know she what? had a pimp. If she had a pimp, she probably wouldn't get a hundred dollars per. Mm. 
But still, that's. I think she was just on her way somewhere. He caught her at the right time. Isn't it funny? No matter, even legally, you, part of your money goes to some other person. For if you protection. let them know. What do you mean if you let them? Like, that's what taxes are. No. Yeah, for well, we have to pay. But exactly. if you, if you let them, too. no, if you let them, they will take your money from you. But you you could be one of those down bitches that carries a pistol or whatever, bro. They ain't way gonna take your money. Not, that's shit. no way to live. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They're better off with the pimp. <laughs> like, are they? He's for pimping. No. You are for pimping, huh? I'm 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 a self made, bro. <laughs> you, what kind of a hooker are you? <laughs> <laughs> you one of those uh I'm more of a galaxia. Mm. <laughs> I think a gigolo could last longer. What do you mean? Like in the, in game. the game? Yeah, yeah, because you're your own pimp, mm-hmm. right? And, Maybe. And, uh, yeah, I think you can go longer of, it's not like you're dicking it all wait, loose you, and beat are up. Are you, you being a he-bitch, you're going to last longer? <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to be a he-bitch. That's what it, uh, a gigolo is. He's, you a he-bitch. Have you seen it? <laughs> Prostitution Eddie is Eddie Griffith is the best, bro. I don't know. He, you don't know who wrote that. He just made that shit up. Prostitution is not just for women. Men can be prostitutes too. Yeah, yeah, prostitutes. but they're usually like for other dudes. Sometimes. Mm-hmm. No, I think most of the time. <laughs> most of the time. No, and there's some dudes that I mean I don't know. You ever see those little little things that go to your phone? That's like, hey, we have women in your area right now, and that bullshit. No. Uh, yeah. Like on the porn sites, some of yeah. the porn sites and shit. I was like, hmm. It always shows some grandma with big old giant tits. I'm like, she's in my area. I've never seen her. At the, where'd she hang out at? Because <laughs> I know she uses the motherfucking internet. <laughs> I, I saw a billboard for a roofing company that said, hot shingles want to get nailed. Oh, this is good, dude. Everything goes to sex, dude. Fuck. Sex Have sells. you seen that commercial about the 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 Wi-Fi network and shit? And then like there's these two women on the porch going... Oh yeah, she just got the new 5G, whatever, and then somebody in their garage, and and then the girl, the the the, <laughs> uh, the other lady goes, "Man, I love that big gig uh, energy." It's like, and they're making innuendos about how yeah, the guy yeah. it lasts longer, he's stronger and shit. I'm like, motherfuckers, dude, give me that Wi-Fi, bro. <laughs> Is that big supposed to be? If you don't have that Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi, dude, you don't have big gig, big gig energy, bro. So is that directed towards women or men? I just a play on words. Well, I know that, but I'm just saying. I don't know. I think it's just for families in general. <laughs> it's your family. If you man ain't got that big gig energy, what are you doing? <laughs> Which, you ironically, having that 5G would probably give you, uh, be, make you impotent. Why? I don't know. It does something to you. Everybody has these like theories and shit. It's like, your, shut up. Your testicles uh, yeah, or know, some man. shit. Ah, whatever, man. <clears throat> I'm People? just saying, cavemen probably got harder. People used to think bloodletting was a thing. You know? They still do. Have you ever seen that? They put a towel around their neck, and then they puncture a little hole in their forehead, and blood starts No, I heard that's how out. you get, uh, what is it called? Uh, Migraines. Takes no, that's how you get hair to grow back. No, not. Th- I'm not talking about that. Not the. I'm talking about one little dot right here in the mm-hmm. middle of the forehead, and you do the, like that. Does that you work? You a little kid, and it gets the blood, pours out of your head into a plastic H-E-B bag, gone, and fucking... Bro. They charge you for that. And your migraine is supposed to go away. Mm. Bloodlet, blood, what did you call it? Bloodletting. Bloodletting. Blood yeah. Yeah, yeah. Leeching. Yeah. No, that's like drinking your own urine. It's it doesn't help. No. It's just put two leeches on your do. balls and you'll go. Lo- you'll last longer in the haystack. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go, dude. <laughs> <laughs> My wife's calling me. Dude. I gotta get the fuck out of here. <laughs> she's just like, oh, she just got the le- <laughs> she just got the leeches. <laughs> That is for something, though, isn't it? Leeches. But no, that was proven wrong. No. What was hey, it? Apparently, Diddy did do it. Mm. Have you mm. seen that? Uh, did do what? He beat the Diddy, crap out of his girlfriend. Diddy grabs his girlfriend oh by the God. hair. Yeah. He chases her down like in his towel, too. You saw the video? <laughs> yeah. He apologized. And then he grabs her, and he slams her on the ground, and she's like all... Yeah, and he grabs She's her crying. by the hair and he starts pulling her. He's thing. very strong. But did they Pretty show her what guy, she yeah. did though? <laughs> <laughs> no, we, they didn't. That's in his defense. We don't know what she. How bad did I get you? Did I get you? With what? I don't know. He's yeah, on you, dude. his apology was just like I was in the wrong. There's no. There's n- I have no. Uh, uh, there's no reason for me to do that. Da, da, da. Damn, they sent the SWAT team to his house for that shit. Fuck, dude. 
No, dude, it's other shit. Bro, other First shit. of all, bro, don't even get me started on this. Really? You don't want you don't want to unleash this tentacle of conspiracy. Well, apparently it's how the far the rabbit hole you gone? Video. <laughs> how far down the rabbit hole have you gone? <laughs> Nothing. I'm just talking shit. But I know that your dick got hard as soon as I said it. <laughs> Wait, you made that video thing up or what? <laughs> no, no, it's no, a real no. Video. The video thing is real. Oh, then what the fuck? No, but I have I have heard that. Uh, Are you trying to edge Josh over here? That or? P Diddy might be a a, a, a villain. No, a something something uh, something asset. Yes, he mm. was a CIA asset. Ah, dude, he was don't, used don't to, mess it up. Dude, you he was put used it on a to fucking compromise. You can't ever get monetized because of you. Used, I think you might be compromised. Jesus Christ. Compromise you know we got ads on the last artist. podcast? Uh, I was like, Apparently, finally, dude. Kim Kardashian as well. Uh, she mm-hmm. would get men in these uh, predicaments, we'll call them. Compromising yeah. positions. Yes. Yeah. And um, so she was a part of it. And but. I mean... <laughs> Oh, you know, we oh, had oh, a soundboard. Oh, 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 oh. I, I think I think oh, all I of them it. are part of it. It's, <laughs> it's all a big cabal of just uh, you know sex offenders. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. the worst mm-hmm. one is like the Podesta uh, tapes that they said that they have. Yeah, and that like out of I don't know how many police officers. No, that that's the Wiener, the Anthony Weiner laptop. That oh, nine, yeah, but nine Pode- out of the twelve officers that have yeah. that saw it are committed suicide. And Podesta was like. Oh, it's prevalent. Basically killing somebody on it or whatever. It's and the it fact was, that it no- was under a file called insurance policy. And the Ooh. fact that nobody is being arrested, that none of this being talked arrested. about, yeah. <sighs> that it's like... No, bro, I mean, hey, that's what, that, that, that's by what criminals, goes to show dude. you, dude. Yeah. Stay in your house, bro. Ran by criminals. And if you don't agree with you, we'll, we'll crash your helicopter. Yep. That's what happened to Kobe. I was going to say the Iranian... <laughs> Present. I don't know if that's true. <laughs> no, that's what happened to Kobe. But look, I think we can all agree that they were both uh, good men today. that made some bad decisions. It was their Iranian president just died, and um, I forgot who the other one. They they shot him four times. Oh, the one from uh, not Romania. Four uh, times it was, it was one of them. Like uh, Yugoslavia, Yugoslavia or, or some shit. You, yeah, something. four times sounds like an accident. Dude. He didn't sign what the Slovakia or some who shit. wanted the World Health Organization, and that's why. They, so it's like maybe. Maybe, I mean, there's a lot of coincidences, and uh, mm. and it and you know what I'm finding? It's hard to care about every conspiracy. Of like, course. I'm, I feel like I'm, I've ate too much ice cream. Yeah, mm. and it's not is that fu- satisfying though. Ice cream? No, well, I uh, if you like ice cream, you know what I mean. If you cake, whatever <sighs> the fuck you want, you jacked off a bunch, uh, whatever you're. you're it just it just feels satisfying. It feels satisfying, but now I feel I feel like I've overindulged in conspiracies, mm. and I don't want to. I don't want to watch. I can't watch anything. I'm watching that fucking Roaring Kitty guy from GMC. They're like, watch his videos backwards. He's telling you. And I sat there for an hour. Watching it backwards? Watching his videos backwards. And it does. It tells the story. But the point I'm saying is that I'm going down too many rabbit holes. I don't have time. Wasting your fucking time, bro. I'm wasting my energy. And, and most of those are not e- never even going to be proven or accepted. Not going to be proven. So it's. It, I went from indulging because I'm like, this is fun. I like it, mm-hmm. like sports, to I've going back uh, and, and, and taking a few steps back and being the old conspiracy theorist was like, I'm going to do something about this, like a dumbass, because <laughs> you're not. You're not going to do anything about this. No, you can do about it. Wait, wait, you're just wasting your time. I know, you, but that's when you first start. You think you know something. And so like, I'm going to wake up the world. <laughs> oh. And then. <laughs> Ew, yeah. dude. Yeah. Oh, my God, dude. That's how I know I went. Fuck, I, man. I, I the gayest thing I've ever heard you Shit like that. I, don't, I can't be friends with you sometimes, dude, because I of shit like that. I indulge too much in these conspiracies. And it, 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 uh, it, it's affecting my You know, my, my favorite one right Ugh. now is, is that, that our government uh, discovered warp drive. They did. It's in Antarctica. Oh, so, no, God, no, dude. Uh, <laughs> it has to do with the uh, uh, the Malaysian flight that disappeared. Yes, 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 but yes. The, but it, went, the, it, it went through a war. It went, but but the way they charge the machines, it's in it, it's in it's in Antarctica. <laughs> yes, dude. I love it's that. Every Antarctica time I kinda like, no, I agree with this. Like, oh, you don't even know the half of it. <laughs> I just discovered Antarctica. Did you know there's an underground lab? In it? No, it's not a, even cold. It's like actually all fake ice. There's a country the it's size all dry ice, dude. of the United States, and it's and it's full of forests. The hollow <laughs> earth. No, it's not hollow. It's we still got, round. We got, we got kicked off of uh, uh, TikTok. Again? Oh, we almost got ticked, uh, 
they told me to take down this this video. This is the news, by the way. And yeah, you can't play news on the TikTok. funny. Sh- yes, you can if you're reacting to it. But they no, said I that we were bullying and harassing. This Ooh. is hate speech. They said this was hate speech, dude. Hey, what the CCP this says. Is, this is the goes. news, by the way. Um, hold on. There's a window shopper. I support Trump against this corrupt two-tier justice system. That's why I'm here to show my support as a black man for Trump. And I'm wearing my shirt, niggas for Trump 2024. Yeah, of course they're. That's no. How is that right? hate speech? That's not hate speech. Because they took the fucking video, but they will let you talk like this all fucking day, because there is a fucking hidden agenda. Okay. And the what? thing is, I don't understand why this speech is allowed, but yet that guy expressing himself and us calling puto of the day is bad. But yet they'll let you talk oh, about I'm like scared. this. Anytime Jewish people are making tunnels, I'm like, what? they'll let you talk about that shit you, all okay, fucking you, you, day. You, you, you cut out a bunch of shit that. All right. <laughs> I didn't cut out. I just want to hear the, all your whole hate speech. It wasn't hate speech at all. <laughs> I didn't say anything. Hateful. But dude, they were like, "Hey, this is harassment, boo." So I appealed it, and they were like, "Man, nigga, you know you foul." And I was like, "What? <laughs> what? Yeah, it was crazy." Somebody reviewed it and said, "No." Oh, has, has my mic been on the whole time? Yeah, it was on. So no, no, they yeah they said um you, uh you can't show I, I forgot what the fucking message. Let me look at the fucking message, bro. That shit fucking oh, hurt this it was shit out of me. Spelled out. Because Spe- uh, it was spelled out, you think? Yeah, I think that was why. I don't know, dude. Yeah. I don't know. Dude. So what they do on TikTok shit was crazy, man. What they do on TikTok is whenever you, they say the N word and it's like a white or Mexican or whatever kid, they go like this when the N word comes up. If they're not black, they go. Mm. So they'll be singing the song and then when that comes mm. out, they go like that. Mm. I'm sure that's just something that like a couple of kids did. No, a lot of them are doing that on TikTok. I watch a lot of kids on TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude, dude, stop, man. No, dude, I'm telling you. <laughs> I've seen them. I've personally. seen them all. <laughs> I filmed for them. <laughs> anyway, I'm just weird because like my Mercury's in Gatorade, Retro-beat. you know. <laughs> <laughs> my Mercury's presenting right now. <laughs> my Mercury. What was that drink? Uh, it had a Puma on it. You remember that drink? It was kind of. It was kind of like the people thought it was alcohol, but it was not. Remember that shit? Oh, absinthe. No, it was called uh, J- Justin. Do you remember that shit? Justin? No. Mm-hmm. With a Puma? Anyway. <clears throat> yeah, like a club? Puma on there or something or a Jaguar or something. Anyway, I don't know what the point of that was. Lean? I was just thinking about it. <laughs> just, just thinking it about lean? it. I think I think I don't know what it is, man. They took down that guy expressing himself and us calling Buto of the day and laughing at him. You say we were bullying. Now, was he bullying? The video was bullying like, oh, no. I I, I did put hashtag Biden only on they, it. Because uh, they, I don't know. I think they feel like you're being racist. There you go. Yep. At the it, it's like. They don't even know I, I'm black. I'm black, dog. But that's the thing, though. They, I'm yelling. They, uh, it's kind of like a religion. You know, it's like a Christian person kind of like, I don't like those cuss words. And then take yeah. them out, but it's because it's secular and they don't know it's a religion. They know you by heart. They know you're you have hate. In They're your heart. like he's he's getting away with something. Yeah, you have hate in your heart, and they felt it. <laughs> We're watching a lot of Billy Carson. Have you been watching him? Yeah, we yeah. watched him for years. We're watching uh, uh, him together as a family. Mm-hmm. And Veronica's like, I just don't know what side what side he's on, like what side of the fence. I'm like, it sounds like he's just saying facts, or what he thinks are facts. Mm-hmm. He's just reading from these tablets. I don't think he has like. Oh, uh, she's like, yeah, but this comes like from what? Where did they come from? Billy like Carson, God, what are you, you know. About? She's talking about like there is a God though. So he's where? Talking, the, 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 basically look him up. Ancient, it'll, ancient it'll, it'll civilizations. Oh, and only that. he can read the Aramaic or Sumerian. Mm-hmm. There's some Sumerian tablets. Did I say Aramaic? Where, That's not where, what I mean. Where, the, where, where he says, like, the real history comes from. And, yeah. And uh, have, are they, like, legit? I have no idea. I mean, from what he says, yeah. He, he says that uh, the ancient Sumerian tablets, even older than that, he can read them, he can decipher them or some shit. And it's all, if everybody translated it for you over to Did he go to, like, school or, like, for that? I mean, I'm assuming he's I think he education. has a school. 
Mm. Yeah. He and has, so he he's telling you that, like, you know, these are stories about real people. You got a degree from your own school? Like, yeah. Like, yeah. one of the things he says is, like, uh, Adam is not a, uh, one man and one woman Eve. It's Adam, Adam, which means the first, the yeah. first uh, human. Basically, he says that some alien people came down, humanoid, right? They came down. They saw these uh, cave people, the Neanderthals, right? Not they, the Neanderthals were not Homo sapiens yet. Mm. So they they were like, "Listen, we need someone to mine our shit because we got gold." Remember got that gold. spirit science thing I showed you in El Paso? Oh yeah, that's what he's saying. Yeah, he's saying the same mm. thing. Yeah, the Anunnaki and all that. And so he was like, "You know what, man? Man, let me scoop one of these these motherfuckers up." So he's like, "Yo, drink this DNA, dog." And so the no, they put it in an alien, and she gave birth. Yeah, well, not an alien. Well, the whatever they the, put it. No, they put. They it got in a the, human to impregnate an alien. So no, they got. They're a, not human no, though. No, the Neanderthals human. are not they, human. They were, oh, I mean, my bad. They got a Neanderthal to impregnate. They mixed uh, an their alien? DNA with with, a, with, with a, a Neanderthal or and whatever. And then humans came from that. Yeah, and then pow, they pow, gave pow, birth, pow. and they're yeah. like, "This is a dom, and it's the first man." And then they and then they the, made a they made humans to be enslaved to work for them. Yeah, and the garden was really just. Uh, but to a you lab. Know, to go through with it, they must have been pretty humanoid themselves. Yes, right. Yeah. So one of them, the You're guy in the that image of me. Yeah. Well, for the Neanderthals to be like, you know, they didn't got a booty like pow pow pow. Well, no, choice, I, bro. I think he was talking about the Neanderthals being like one of the like they tried different types of yeah of yeah human oh right right type right. species. Right. So this went on for like thousands of years, and they finally cultivated a nice group, and they were. Worshiping them as gods, and they had in their DNA is like super, you know, advanced, and they figured out immortality and blah blah blah. But then they got all horny for the females, and they're like, "Man, I'm gonna fuck these." Yeah, girls. one of them was like, "Yo, I'm gonna go show her fire real quick." Dog. And so they started fucking all, and they made giants apparently. Yeah. Oh, is that where the uh, giants on Earth come from? Uh, yeah. yeah, the Bible thing. The Nephilim are the children the of Nephilim, the yeah. of the fallen angels. Or, 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 so the fallen angels what were the those? people did, from the sky, just, basically. They just died out. They were hmm? killed in a flood. Which ones? Who? The the big giant. The ones. Nephilim. Oh no, they have heart, heart conditions. <laughs> <laughs> they enlarged whores, though. <laughs> They were, they, were, the they were more gas busters, <laughs> dog. My pituitary. I don't know what it is for my pituitary. I drink food. I drink five gallons of milk. <laughs> Noah, Noah's flood. They were all killed. Yeah, so Noah and Methuselah and all them, <laughs> they were, uh, and Methuselah. Samuel. <laughs> Yeah, yeah you know, he was there too. Yeah. <laughs> so they were all like still winding down from the DNA that they had ingested. <laughs> that's down. why that's why they lived for so long because these guys were immortals and they're like, yo, these guys are getting too thinky and shit, oh, bro. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna take out that little piece. So through generations, they kept taking out pieces yeah, of DNA. Yeah, they took that out would... something in our DNA that that's why we only live up to possibly yeah. 120 oh, years. Oh, to not be as because our long lasting. Yeah, yeah, that we should live a thousand years. It's like the sure. president's term; he can only rule for so long. So that's he, how, that's, he, that's how he also do. says he saw uh, that aliens came into his house, yeah, and that he saw them and he couldn't scream or move and like he felt like he was gonna his brain mm-hmm. was gonna explode. And they were speaking Spanish or some shit. Yeah, you know, something what, before like COVID, Portuguese. I would have just dismissed that. I was like, "There's no way that happened. That man is mentally ill," yeah. which is very more than likely. No, but um, <laughs> after COVID, I'm like, you know what? Anything is possible. Dude. Well, his whole family left him because of it. Oh, uh, no, but he, that makes sense. He dude, left you can't them. ask that much. No, of people. to protect them, he had to leave them because he's a target. Mm. I thought it's because he had a hot Asian wife. Now I was about to say, uh, he did he happen to, to find a? <laughs> no, a I mean, he wanted to. He's a, he's a wealthy guy. I mean, he could have. I mean, yeah, he's a millionaire now. Dave he's Chab- a wealthy guy now. He is because of his uh, what's it called? Uh, yeah. Speeches or whatever. Yeah. Books. He's on everything. He was on Rogan. He's on, on other everything. clips. I, I saw. Think he was on Rogan. <laughs> yeah, he was. He was on he Rogan. Was. Yep. I thought he was on, uh, he was on Blogan. No, he was on Blogan. I don't remember him on Rogan. Maybe he was on Blogan. I don't know. I gotta, I don't think I gotta so. check it out. Anyway, he's, he's like a very interesting guy to watch, no matter what. So we're just listening to it. Real Terrence my. Howard of a guy. No, yeah. Terrence Howard is a fucking crazy person. Bro. What? I heard. Yeah, he's a crazy. Why person. is he a crazy person? Just he's so smart that you think he's crazy. No, no, no. He's going around in circles. So. He's not putting so uh, he's not putting his genius to use. He's because just because the world is circular. There you Duh. go. There's no yeah. straight lines. Did you not hear what he said? 
yes, now what? You know what I mean? He's proving math wrong. Yeah. This is the deconstruction of society. You know that, right? Yeah. And you're saying he's he's an agent of Yes, yes. What else does he have left? He has nothing else left. No one, and this is why no one wants to work with him. He was pissing me off. I want to see him in like more movies. He can't keep his fucking mouth shut. Man, he's 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 a genius. He was born a genius. Swallow that jizz in your mouth, bro. <laughs> you always do that. <laughs> Ugh. You want to spit all the time because you're used to spitting. Yeah. Ugh. So fucking gross, dude. He has like a big fucking thing, like it's full of semen. He's just so fucking <laughs> gross, dude. I'm 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 glad you stopped. I didn't. All right. <laughs> oh shit. I thought that was just a phase. Zen. Is that the new you now? That's the new me. Oh my god! Zen you for life. I I kept it in the car though. I wanted to. No, grab he was it. telling I me. I thought you were gonna say I kept it a secret for him. <laughs> <laughs> I've been dipping for twenty two years. You kind of snuck that one. Zen. Yeah, dude. I I learned to like it. I didn't like it at first. How'd you pick it up? Why Why would you like want it. to continue with something you don't like? It was like no, an now, arranged marriage. Now I like it. Mm. Now I you like learn it. to love it at some point. Change it changed my and taste buds. And now to me and your father. Are I like goof. I like diet coke now. I like bitter. Oh no, zero coke zero is the best. Bro. I don't like coke zero. The yes. extra taste is gross. I never like diet hit him, hit. I, I main vein it, dude. Did I, dope. I never liked diet <laughs> coke either, but diet coke turned, is good. No, too. but I like fairly dislike it. I did too. Oh really? Yeah. Dude, no. I can't drink mm. a regular soda now because Zin changed my taste buds and mm. my gums are receding. What do you mean Zin? Zin, the nicotine. The little patch. Oh right, right, Little right, right. Little yeah. pouch. Yeah. Oh okay, yeah. Little pouch. Little pouch I put in my mouth. A little pouch he puts in his. <laughs> I man put my pouch in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I put my pouch in your mouth. <laughs> yeah, dude. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> I put my pets in the back. Stupid. When are y'all gonna oh grow up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just uh, it it keeps you awake. Stop driving. Uh-huh. Does it really? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it helps you. It helps you. I mean, nicotine is a stimulant. Yeah, but any like I've never like. Anytime I've been, I've been like falling asleep, a cigarette never really perked me up. It's different for everybody. It's a chemical change. The chemical change is different for most folks. So it was like my dad, when he used to smoke, he's like, I was feeling tired. He's fucking smoking a cigarette. I feel the, he would, he would feel awake, you know. Mm. But I'm like you. I don't feel that shit at all. Yeah. You know? Even when you first started smoking? <sighs> when I was a kid? <laughs> no, I used to get they, I used to get high from cigarettes, bro. He was like bro. five when he started smoking. I know. Yeah, I was a little kid. My first cigarette was like at seven, bro. What time What time was it? Uh, Marble Light, my aunt. You stole it? No, she gave us a cigarette to light fireworks with. Oh. <laughs> she didn't trust us with a lighter, so we would go. She's like, don't inhale it, just puff on it. <laughs> and, we, and me and my brother were like, give me that cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> Lighting sh- bottle rockets off the fence and shit. All high shit. We were fucking cigarette. geeked out, bro. <laughs> 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 fucking like, like this, like, come on, man. Fuck. When did Drying you stop? Our and shit, bro. When did you stop feeling high from cigarettes? Ten. Um. No, I. I mean, I wouldn't. I wouldn't smoke them. Like smoke them. I started smoking on the regular when I was like maybe thirteen, maybe, bro. Yeah. Thirteen. On the reg. On the reg, dog. And I felt so bad that Catholic was in me, bro. I used to sneak out of my window and be outside of my house and be like, God, please. I've never smoked a cigarette again. I'm so sorry. I used to beg God to help me quit smoking cigarettes. And afterwards, I was like, are you there? How old are you? Huh? How old are you? I didn't start smoking cigarettes until I was like 26. Damn, God the bless drugs? You. Was it the yeah. drugs are like oh? You got baby lungs. Twenty six, twenty seven. That's what I'm saying. The drugs are like oh, the cigarettes nice after. Yeah. yeah oh yeah, bro. Nice, dude. Dude, you know I'm saying like steak and potatoes. You hit a <laughs> port. You ever hit a port? A port. Like a new port? No. Well, actually, yeah, I have. <sighs> Extra strength, bro. They're they're not bad. They're not bad. I used to smoke those when I was a kid. Yeah, I used, I used to, to smoke Marlboro Marlboro Menthols. Mm-hmm. I used to smoke uh, wine, Black and Miles. Yeah, Black and Miles. I would 
I was like 15, at the end of the night, miles and shit. I'd smoke a wine. Did you get like a nice like buzz? Oh, if you inhaled it, bro, oh, you got yeah, fucking fuck you up. buzz and then you got sick. Yeah. If you just puffed on it, though, your whole mouth would be all numb and shit. Really? Yeah, it's a cigar. But I mean, cigar. you would... A cigar. Mm, I, I, didn't, I didn't smoke cigarettes because a girl called me out and I felt stupid because I was like, yeah, let me get the cigarette. And the game, I'm started... She's like, you're not even inhaling, you're puffing on it. And I was like, oh, you're a uh, what? Oh, I put it out. What? Ah! <laughs> I'll burn you, bitch. Yeah, like our buddy in. Uh, to me, feel stupid. I was like, all right, cool, I gotta go, guys. In Afghanistan, like this guy was like smoking cigarettes for like the whole time he had been in the unit for like eight or nine months, mm-hmm. and then one day people just realized that he wasn't inhaling the whole time. And then they told him, no, you got to inhale it. And then when he started inhaling it, he started getting all dizzy and shit. Hell yeah. Because the, the whole time he'd just been like. Wow, That's exactly what guy. I was doing. Yeah. Just getting mouth cancer for no reason and shit. But he went like nine months. He went like nine months. Nobody noticed. Jesus Christ, dude. Nobody paid attention. I wish that girl didn't pay attention. Actually, no, I don't. She got me to not smoke. Mm. I got people to hey, smoke. Good on her, man. Yeah. And she fucked my friend. Yeah, Jesus. He wasn't your friend, bro. They both weren't your friend. <laughs> smoking cigarettes, right? I started smoking, and then my brother, I was like, here, smoke a cigarette, bitch. And he was like, we're both smoking and shit, like little kids. Skipping school, like, hey, we're going to go smoke cigarettes. And then we go, we go to the mall. And my, we, would, uh, we would get them, man, by any means necessary, dog. Man, you were hoodlums stand, stand, straight stand up, outside right? and you ask people. You were the little people. donkey kids from Pinocchio. Yeah, we really were, man. We just uh, just misguided. It's a bad you know? seed. Bad seed for sure. <laughs> if you were, if if it was to be done, we were doing it. <laughs> straight up, dog. <clears throat> uh, you were exploring the world and your bodies. It's such a waste of time, though. All that shit was a waste of time, you know. I don't yeah. know. Do you wish you would have had structure? What going around and bullshitting? Fucking shit. Yeah, just having no, absolutely no care. Like I had no bills. I had no all. I, all I needed was gas money, and we were out there, bro. But now you have stories that you're slowly forgetting. <clears throat> I know <laughs> this is true. This is true, and I age. I age terribly. You know. I have five. When what does it be like when you're fifty? I age terribly. Huh? He was getting 50? mad because people call him Carlos Mencia online. Still. Yeah. <laughs> and he was like, "Do you mean looks or my jokes?" <laughs> You read it? <laughs> no, you told me about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> you an idiot. <laughs> delete comment. <laughs> it's my favorite. It's my favorite two you words. Like, delete you comment. look like him. Calm down, bro. And he's like, all right. No, nah, I didn't say all right. You did read it. No, I didn't. Yeah, you told did. me about it. That's I told you that, and you remembered verbatim no, how yes, they wrote it? Yes, because I thought it was funny. Didn't, uh, didn't you say like a long time ago, like three or four years, like he's trying to fight the internet. He like, yeah. You can't do that. Yeah, he was going after everybody in our comments on, <laughs> on the fucking podcast. I'm going after him, bro. I found out everybody lived. <laughs> I was like, why are you getting mad at people, dude? Because they're stupid. Who just writes yeah, the hateful shit in the it? Internet just don't watch real it. And it will, don't yeah. support it, you know? That's their way of not supporting Motherfuckers. Negative comments get people to write back. Positive comments, everybody just likes or hearts it. Yeah. We'll crawl inside your head and look out your eyeballs, man. Get I'm, I'm getting my old age. I'm using it to learn instead of being entertained now. That's crazy. So what YouTube's for. I'm learning so many, not even just YouTube, like just information, pricing. I fucking priced out some flooring. I, I know how to do... Other shit from like, not like, okay, what do I need, right? And so I'll go down the list of everything I need for that fucking certain project now. It's like, holy fuck, like, <clears> it's <throat> fucking crazy, dude. I know a lot about HVAC now because of it. HVAC, I know a lot about HVAC too. Didn't think I'd Fucking have to know. bananas, man. HVAC. Yeah. And I'm yeah. talking I'm talking to these guys about AC and they're like, and then what happened? I was like, and then he put 18 pounds of Freon in a tune ton system. He's like, how the fuck did he do that? I'm like, that's what I'm saying. I'm like trying to, and then they start yeah. talking to me and they're going to, they go past me, and I'm like, oh, I don't, I, I don't know. What I can hold my own about. now, bro. I can I hold can. my own now, dude. Have you tried applying any of these things, or you just yes, watch it? yes? What did you do? I, I am, uh, I'm gonna put some shit on my Jeep, and uh, so you need to, oh, hell you no. can't just put it on. You gotta like, you gotta uh, set the, um, you, you gotta do like a re-gearing for it. If you get bigger tires. You gotta do re gearing. Gotta put spacers. You gotta put fucking. You gotta replace the. T- I gotta replace the fucking tie rods. I gotta replace. Is that something that can get done in a day? Yes, it can get done in the day. But it's pretty much a whole day thing. Uh maybe four hours at the most. Yeah, yeah. 
I learned sound? about man kegels. Man kegels? Yeah. It's a thing. <clears throat> what is that supposed to do? Like, just make you hold it in longer? Wait, what? The kegel? Like, male kegel. Like, what are you doing? Your back pussy or what? Well, you can use it for that. And that way they can't get in. You can put a barricade. No, I think they're going to get in. It's Everything's going to hurt Everything's getting more. squeezed at once? Your taint and more. your asshole? Mm. No, but it's not. you're actually supposed to do, uh, when you do a kegel, man kegel, you're supposed to relax your asshole because then you're just strengthening your asshole. That's not what, you want to do. <laughs> what you want to do is strengthen the oh, tubes. Oh, my gains are in my asshole, bro. I can't, I can't oh, I'm hit doing that. It now. I'm doing it now. <laughs> Don't do it now. I'm doing it now. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, it's working. <laughs> look, look, look. <laughs> why do you? Why do you? Act, why, you see my dick when you close your no, eyes? No, you go oh, slow on the on the uh, on the relaxing. <laughs> on, yeah, the release. You clench fast and slow on the relax. Oh. Yeah, you do. You got to hold it for two. You One both are fucking two, weirding two. me out, dude. Hold it for two. You should feel it in your taint. We're gonna have a man kegel uh, course. <laughs> She's all of us sitting uh, crisscross well, apples. Like, <laughs> <laughs> you're getting a hemorrhoid. That's what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> what you do is you put a wet towel, a beach towel, over your dick when you have a boner. You just do. If you can't pick up a can of soda right. with your ass, I don't know what you do. <laughs> this is not the right Kegels. <laughs> this is not the right Kegels. That is, that's a perfect Kegel. No. I'll crush it. I'll ways crush too. a dick if it comes near me. That's a self-defense Kegel. No, sir. <laughs> no, sir. That's what you not yell today. in your, your self-defense class. No, sir. <laughs> Man, Kegel on three. You gotta twist I don't know it. you. I don't. So if you did, <laughs> <laughs> I'm straight. <laughs> have you noticed? Um, have you guys logged into any like dirty websites or what? Nope, just X. X videos. Twitter. Mm. Damn, you just straight up Twitter. Twitter, you Twitter, just, you dude. Twitter it sometimes <laughs> is. <laughs> <laughs> it's the most efficient way. <laughs> and it's not even you're looking for it. There, I'm like, dude, Twitter sometimes, bro. <laughs> 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 so stare off for you saw a video right now. I the, did. I saw the scrolling. Saw the scrolling. I was like, wow. <laughs> and it knows. Yo, it knows at the now, right bro. time of night. <laughs> <laughs> all day. It's just for me. It's all like Bitcoin, Iran, World War Three. And all of a sudden, eleven o'clock at night. <laughs> where did that come from? Why? Hey. No, it's never that. It's always just a picture of a girl with like one titty, mm-hmm. and then you click on the. No, I get like the popular um, accounts will start going like, you can't believe, you'll never believe the leaked video that she. It's an ad, yeah. mm-hmm. and then underneath oh. the girl put it like, that's me, oh. and then followed by a ton of porn. <laughs> yeah, just a bunch of different porn, and then it's scary because you might accidentally repost or like it. Oh mm. my god! It's that right? Isn't that terrifying? I I scroll so much slower, so much more careful. I think good old Greg, you know, he had his ways, man. But you know, he he's trying to keep the babies alive and trying to keep me, you know, from uh, enjoying myself. Being an addict, man. Enjoying my body. It's crazy because I feel like porn is finding me. I'm not trying to find porn. Porn it's going is just, out to look right. I'm just, yeah, I'm just scrolling, and then all of a sudden, right. there's a nice ass. That's and what I, I tell Veronica. On that. I'm being targeted. <laughs> and then and you scroll on that and it's just the comments underneath i don't even know what's going on i don't this is my information already got sold and bought like a million times over so they're obviously know that we're having problems <laughs> it's big tech listen we can't fight it okay might as well just watch it together because of in- instagram instagram or make one will stop at a certain point mm-hmm. you know what i mean Wait, what Instagram? Was that? Instagram? Like we'll stop Instagram. It's like the HBO, not even, mm. uh, of, of porn. Like, porn? it's not porn. It's just a girl with a, like, a, mm. about to show her nipple, or it's like, I hate the fucking breastfeeding with a fake baby bullshit. Just uh, so she can show her titty. Okay. But what I'm saying, though. What? <laughs> You're foul, dude. How am I foul? <laughs> you type in breastfeeding? No, it popped up. Uh, get out of here, dude. It popped up. Breastfeeding. <laughs> Bro, dude, dude. You're a scumbag, oh dude. God. First Jesus thing that pops up. See Christ, what I mean? Dude, let me see. Let me see. It's the first thing that pops up. Oh, my God. What? But what you know what? Mean? That's very fatherly of you because you sit there and you're like, have my baby. <laughs> I guess I know. See? Guzzling. Most of Guzzling. it, Guzzling. Bitcoin and everything, and then all of a sudden. It's because we're talking about titties. That's why it popped up right now. Let me see, though. 
Whatever my child consumes, I consume. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I guess, dude. Yeah, it's pretty harmless, I guess. Yeah, it is. But then you click on the link underneath, and it's just a bunch of pornography. Type in pornography. Type, type, ga- type in gangbang. No. I don't. <laughs> hey, type in. Uh, no, I don't type. It. You know what you could just do? Just like uh, not put watch your, it. Put your browser on private and do whatever the fuck you want. You know what I mean? You know what's you know what's crazy too is like you'll be scrolling through this. Uh-huh. You. Click on that picture, and then you'll scroll like three or four, and then it'll just be a sign where it's like a person going, Jesus loves you. <laughs> and I was like, all right, I get it. They're doing it on purpose. I know I they're doing it on purpose. on purpose. They're doing it on purpose. Otherwise, they win. Jesus still loves me? Even or, after or, all or, the- uh, <laughs> it'll be a picture of like some flowers, but if you kind of look back, it's just the face of Jesus, and it's like it's one of those AI kind of two different pictures that you have on there. I don't know. I'm starting not to do it as much anymore. Good for you. Yeah, I just. You were addicted to porn for a long time. <laughs> no, I, just I mean like we to don't watch, watch out it. with I technology. Like, I don't go dude. crazy with it. You know what I mean, you were pretty flamboyant. You're so porn. fucking bored, huh? You're pretty flamboyant. With flamboyant. Your porn. What the fuck does that mean? I mean, stylish. Though. Look at that. <laughs> what does that mean? Yeah. Flamboyant? No, you no, oh, say it like a rapper from the nineties. Oh, oh he in the butt. Son. That that that's being flamboyant with your porn. You... No, that's just a funny phrase. <laughs> flamboyant, dude. There's there's funny everywhere. Every aspect of life, there's hilariousness, dude. You just gotta find it. You gotta be looking for it. It'll hit you when it hits you. But, I don't. Um, I can't. I can't go through the the muck like that. The muck. The muck. I mean, I'm not like searching for it; just coming to me. I'm like an open book. You know, my third eye is open to porn. Yeah, (laughs) that's what I'm saying. There's things. I'm like an antenna. There's like things that you've (laughs) seen. Being being targeted on on porn that I know would fuck with me, like mentally. No, I I wouldn't. Yeah, he's a porn dumpster. You never, you never (laughs) challenge yourself, then, dude. Come on. Yeah, there's some things I don't want to challenge myself with. Yeah. How do you know what you're made of if you don't if you don't ever I know my limitations. Nah, I put yeah. I put those limitations it's on breastfeeding me. videos. Yeah, you're that's there's something sinister about that. I bro. am not watching. It's different that. when I say oh pee in her mouth type shit, but you're like breastfeed. Like that's no. that's like actually that's pretty wholesome. No, that it's not wholesome. That was a feed his children. That's that's like you not like you, no. but that's like oh I, I go to the park to watch kids and shit. You know, no. like ew, dude, what the fuck is wrong with you? My, okay, what I, what I don't I, do anything. I just no. watch them play. Like what, yeah, that's wholesome. I what, guess what, fucking weirdo. What I'm, what, it's like the stabbing video. Remember that that one that we saw. That, that's wholesome. That's murder. It's part of life. <laughs> <laughs> like I knew that I didn't want to have that Im- image in my head, so that's yeah. why I didn't watch it. Yeah, and you felt it after. Like fuck, why did I watch? Watch that. Yeah, but I could see it again. I don't give a fuck. I don't want to see it. Like, I'll forever have it burn in my head when my friend thought it was funny to show me that fucking horse that fucked that dude in the ass and he ends up dying. Mm-hmm. That burned in my head. Where's this? Damn. I wish I didn't have it in my head. Can you find it? I don't want to find <laughs> it. Sometimes you're looking out the window and coughing. You're like, <laughs> you're like oh. we went to a petting zoo yesterday. <laughs> fuck. My, kid, dang, my kids don't know my trauma. Because you see him, you see it come out when you yeah. like he comes out. I don't believe you, dude. Dude, <sighs> you look it up. I no, believe you. I believe you like, saw it. You I saw something. I did see it. It was bad. Like I've seen terrible shit. That's like ah, oh, maybe I shouldn't be privy to this. But that's how the world is, man. No, that's, or that, Edward. That shit just hits the you. one Edward. beheading video that Edward showed me Edward, that I was like, Edward, never again. Today. Which one? And he's like, come on, watch, watch, doing what you did, watch. And then the fucking chainsaw hits. He goes through oh, one neck yeah. and hits the other guy in the shoulder. I was like, yeah. whoa, I can't. What the fuck? Yeah, those are pretty crazy. Dude. Yeah, you wanted me to show, show, show me one of those. I was like, nah, dude, I don't need that shit in my head. There's the level of humanity that people are so far away from. You yeah. Know? I like, they're on a different planet. Two girls, one cup. Couldn't watch that. Yeah, I saw that. That was all right. They freaked me out when you started eating it. I was like, I didn't know that was possible. I didn't know you could actually put it in your mouth and not like, you know, and then she started throwing up. And I was like, oh, thank God she has a soul. You know what I mean? Ugh. No. I saw a guy shit. eat a, a shit sandwich, too. On bum fights or something? Mm, I don't know. Bum oh, fights was okay. fucking dope as fuck. I, I had all those bootleg DVDs. Bum fights, uh, bar fight babes, <laughs> just all women fighting in bars and shit. That's oh, yeah. dope. Ghetto brawls, that shit was dope. Stabbings, all kinds of shit. 
But then again, I was in them streets too. I saw shit like that all the time, you know. So it wasn't like affecting me. But is that me. is that uh, uh, choosing to not see something like that? Is and if putting you have your the head choice, in the sand, dog. That's not. I don't see it as putting your head in the sand. I see it as guarding the gate of your mind. Guarding the gate of your back pussy. Yeah, that too. <laughs> I don't know. It's 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 always those people that are like like someone has a knife and they're gonna stab you and you're like whoa and then they stab you and you're like whoa like you know. Try to fight. Try to fight. You know, you're not believing what's happening right now. You know, so that's why I've always tried to like desensitize myself to certain things, and I, that's why I've been been able to react to certain things. You know what I mean? Like you react to she to she for when shit happens or shit pops off or whatever the fuck. You don't fucking like still be standing there in like disbelief. I think you know reacting I mean? to to a situation which is life threatening is different from having that the that dirt on your fucking. On your fucking body, that not life threatening. Also, when you're just having that, that, like okay, certain there's certain things that images or whatever that you maybe oh, wish you wouldn't have seen that gross you the fuck out, and it sticks with you. So that's what I'm saying. Like I'd rather taking myself out of those situations or not watching it is not mm-hmm. me being like, oh no, I could never be a. Po-. It's it, it, it. It's just I don't want that dirt on me. Yeah. Would you? T- Take a man's manhood for five million dollars? No, what? <laughs> I just wanted to see what your limits were. No, no, no. What? When? <laughs> <laughs> Show me the money first. Because last time I did it, you didn't even. <laughs> what do you mean by taking his manhood? Oh, hold on. Save your family. They have to take your manhood. If not, your whole family does. <laughs> We I'm die gonna, together. I'm gonna say my family, of course. So you're gonna take it. <laughs> <laughs> you're not giving me an option. <laughs> no, there is an option. That is not There's an option. I want to hear you say it. That's not an option. Always an option. Hold on. How could you live with your family after that? Like <laughs> my dad. Fuck they're not it. gonna. They're not gonna know. They're not gonna. No, watch. they have to know. They're it's in the room. They would want. They would want me to survive them. They're in the room. Okay, so you're you're tied to something, a uh, rope that's holding them up. Have you seen that movie? It's called Cy- Cyborg. Is it the one with John Claude Van Damme? <laughs> yeah, dude. And he's like trying to hold him, but it's barbed wire. Yep. Like, so it's something like that, but that's wrapped around your neck, and you got to get railed from behind. <laughs> and if you don't, then you, you I don't know, some, somewhere you're holding uh, it. buck breaking. <laughs> what? Yeah, back in the day, slave masters would do that. They Jesus would take, Christ. They would take the biggest slave they had, and they would. Fuck him in the ass in front of his whole family. No, that's gay. Yeah, very that's much a was. category. That wasn't saw. like a maneuver or something. It was that an was, excuse. That's what they called it, but that was an excuse. But also, that's Fuck what it was it. called. It was real fucked up. Yeah, dude. And what also, oh shit, sure told me that. <laughs> what if there's like, like slave masters? Like, wait, I never did that. <laughs> slave they were like, well, how did that get around? Oh, because they <laughs> hate us. That's why. Who's <laughs> fucking everybody in the ass? That's what yeah, they do in prison too. I mean, I don't know. I'm just saying that. I think I it's more of a power thing, but probably also very gay. But oh, absolutely. Break. Primarily. Primarily. You ever heard of yeah. Breaking Boy? I just want to feel powerful. <laughs> Come here, sissy. Why is that a question to save your family and you're going to get... Why Why was that a question? I would have been like, I'm not answering that. That's ridiculous. But you were like, taking it. <laughs> been waiting to save my family. That's what I said. <laughs> I've been waiting to save my family. <laughs> This is what we talk about. We're grown men. This is what we talk about. Like, we're always testing each other. Okay, would you do it for... Let's just get it over with, huh? Come on. It's always like some crazy... Like, Let's just go down the street. I'm sure we can find it somewhere. But it's like, when you say $5 million, that makes it exaggerated enough. It'd be another thing we were like, well, you know, for 40 bucks? Yeah. How low can you go, dog? Two hundy, right now, cash, <laughs> right now, Venmo. Pick slip to my car and everything. <laughs> I get to be a slave for a week. <laughs> uh, come here, get over here. Take my dry cleaning. I did a I did a podcast with the Dominatrix, mm-hmm. and she was talking about how that they have uh, not they're not simp's they're. Uh, what are they called? Uh, subs. So yeah, submissives. Submissive, yeah. There's Sub. people that apparently live like that. Yeah. Like twenty four seven. Like yep. when they go home, they want to be treated like shit. Like shit, yeah. Oh. I don't. Uh, 
it, know, it's not even like, oh, that's – I don't understand that. She told me – oh, she told me. I've heard that it's mostly like <laughs> high-powered individuals, like uh, mm-hmm. highly educated or highly – Successful in business CEOs, and they want to be treated like Probably garbage. Probably somebody that barks at everybody all day. Yeah, and then they come home and get spit on and shit. They live in a cage, you know. Hmm. I can only yeah. wish people with power, and they want a place where they don't have any power. Well, yeah, it's a fantasy, but they still want the power. Because you know? <laughs> they are one they, of those they're still dog directing. Cages, like, babe, I ran out of water. <laughs> I gotta take a shit. Shit through the fence. <laughs> But it's controlled. They're telling that person to treat them like shit. So it is. It doesn't. This doesn't make any fucking sense. You know. Uh, I would imagine there's some kind of a safe word. No. I'm like, all right, dude, take yeah. it easy. I will turn these fucking lights off. Let me out of the cage. <clears throat> some people just feel like animals inside. They become dogs. No, it's all programming. That's why the first couple of years of your life are very important. Yes. A lot of shit gets programmed in those first what yeah. five or six years or something. Oh fuck! Uh, I'm, yeah, I'm already programming uh, my son not to like. It's like it's, seven. It's, it's funny. Yeah. We're in church, and it's quiet, and he just picks up his head and goes, "Ba, da." <laughs> Everybody's like, Whoa, and they slowly turn and they see him and they're like, "Oh!" And then they smile and they look back. <laughs> right? They're like, of course he's gonna yell like. Oh, that. your baby? Yeah, my baby. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, but the way he yells, it's not like I'm crying. <laughs> it's just I want to be part of. Th- Ah! <laughs> they want to be part of the fucking conversation. And I'm never like, shh, be quiet. He's babbling, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, his babbles are different. His babbles are funny. You got to record them. I want to hear oh, Yeah, they're fucking just every morning. He does that in the morning. That's how you know he's awake. Wah! And he has in your face. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm out of the womb, fuck. Wah! <laughs> First seven years. Yeah, I'm not going to. I'm gonna teach Yeah, go ahead, Papa. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's a dad thing though. Yeah, let it out. Fuck the world. Just cry. Let it out. Scream. Whatever you gotta do. But I think on the wife's side, like, shh, no, no, shh, 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 shh. Yeah. yeah, he already acts different around me. Yeah. It's a, it's a <laughs> more freedom around dad, dude. It's like, eh, you'll be okay. You know? Yeah. The moms they run to him like, oh, They're like, no, let, let, let me fuck alone. Let the Lisa boy alone. Watch. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? You seen that? Let the boy watch. Watch. Mm-mm. What movie is that from? Like two plums. Two plums. Blue uh, hue. You gotta see from, it. From uh, Eastbound and Down. Eastbound and Down. Oh. Will Ferrell plays uh, owner of a dealership. Yeah. You know. Yeah. He's just and saying off the wall. Kevin McBride. No, what's his name? Kevin something. Yeah, uh, Danny McBride. Well, no, his character's name is Kevin something. Kenny Kenny Powers. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Kenny Powers is trying to get the deal with the dealership. It was only like one season, right? No. It was, it was like three. Three, three or season. four? Oh, I Should thought it was like, like six three. or some shit. No. Yeah. Like maybe like four. Three or four. No, I think it was six. I have it on HBO. I, I watched the first three, four seasons already. I wish you weren't such a liar. <laughs> Look it up, dude. How do you think I watch the dirty movies, too? As <clears throat> uh, a matter of fact, the new show I'm watching, huh? It's called uh, uh, Daniel Tosh is hosting it. It's fucking hilarious, bro. What is it's it? called The Goat. It's the greatest of all time tele- reality television star. And so they're in a house and they have to compete doing challenges, blah, blah, and voting, and all the bullshit the reality shows do. What's this? And on? the drama. It's on Netflix. It's fucking hilarious as fuck. Daniel Tosh is like. And you got to stand on this holding a coconut. And if you don't really understand that, I don't really care. And he, like, walks off. It's fucking great, dude. He's like, now you guys got to see her awkwardly leave. Ugh, sucks. You know, as, uh, they're, as they vote off. He says everything that you're not supposed to say in those situations. And they, so they started Wait, arguing. What's it called again? I want to watch this shit. It's called, the, it's called The Goat, bro. It's goat. so funny, bro. So some of the people I kind of knew from, like, Big Brother and whatnot, some people I didn't know, like, oh, they have a TV show called uh, F Boy Island. What the fuck, right? And um, and some some of those women are fucking bad, bro. And some of the dudes are this guy's like, I was on, I won Survivor thirty six. I've never seen the thirty six season of fucking Survivor before, but he won it apparently. And he keeps saying, I'm super athletic, bro. Like, I I want to win all the challenge. He hasn't won one fucking challenge. 
and it keeps count of how many times it says it. It's like all the all the funny shit that like like they're making fun of them. It's, it's so good, bro. That's got to be crazy. I'm on Big Brother 36, and it's just like what? Oh, who Nobody... saw you? I don't so it's know. like a reality show making fun of reality shows. Well, um, no, it's a real thing. But Daniel Tosh just make he does his own testimonials and shit. Oh <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, he'll be like, man, I wish y'all hadn't voted her off. And he looks off in the distance, and he's like. I just think she was the hottest one on the show. I don't know why. I mean, she had the most Twitter followers too. It's like, who's gonna watch this shit anyway? And he comes and he comes back to him going, anyway. All right, well, I'm gonna go to sleep. You guys gotta go argue in the room of why you guys voted her off. And then he leaves and shit. They started arguing because uh, it was a plan to vote this one person off, and like three people didn't vote for that one person. So now they're like, who vote? Who didn't vote for her? And they're all like arguing. He just goes, he just like er, like leaves out of the scene. And then they all realize after like half an hour, they're like. Where's our host at? You know they're still sitting on like by the little like tiki torches and shit on the voting thing. It's fucking hilarious. He <clears throat> is hilarious on the show, bro. He's so mean. It's so good. There's a couple of old people on there. He's all like, "Uh oh, she's gonna break her hip on this chat." Like just making trash and it's so fucking good, dude. It's so good. You know he's one of the dudes that it. didn't that got in without having like uh, like the podcast crew or whatever. At LA, that's still like big. He has a podcast now, but, but yeah. he did. I'm saying it's just him. Yeah, you know what I mean. It's not like him grouped up with anybody. Mm-hmm. It's just a, you know what I mean. So I don't know. He did it a different way. Well, he did it. You know, Dan Cook did the same shit. Like they did it before that shit popped off. Daniel Taj is a uh, marketing major, though. Mm. Really? Yeah, I didn't know that. I know he, you. You, you know how he got into TV and all that? He just Taco lied Bell. about his credits. Oh, really? Yeah, he's like famous for that. He's like, oh yeah, I lied about all my credits and shit. So to get in the clubs, you have to do that shit. What would he say? That he was on TV and he wrote for this person and all kinds of shit. He's like, why would you not lie? That's what they're looking for is for people to either lie <laughs> or actually have it. He's like, no one really has it. If I had it, I wouldn't be trying to get in your fucking C club. And he's just he's hilarious, bro. He's so fucking funny. I know a comic that did that and he got shunned. Do you know a comic that did that? Yeah, and he got shunned. In the right market? Yeah. In Austin. He did it in Austin. He, yeah, he but He lied about writing for a club. He got shunned? I don't know if he got yeah. shunned, bro. Yeah, he got shunned. No, he didn't. By who? By the Austin The crew. comics? No, by the Austin scene, yeah. By the comics, not yeah. by the people who booked the shows and shit. By the people no, who booked the, the shows, too. The, the club? Yeah. Club. People but the hated club him. was kind of like... Uh, the club never gets involved with shit like that, bro. If they do, I don't know. I mean... They just didn't like him, though. Yeah, they probably just didn't like him. Yeah, that's fine. They probably passed on him. They're like, we don't like his comedy or the fuck or whatever. But I, I have yet to see a scene where the comics' voices matter over money, you know? It's Austin. No. In Austin, back then, they, it did matter as far as reputation. Uh, they, they would often ask, like, hey, what's the, what's the deal with so-and-so? So yeah, like local the, comics, but, like, I mean, all these people come, like, Bobby Lee and all them, they still came through Cap, and they had fucking turmoil and shit going on, you know what not, I mean? Not not back then, like, the way they do now. Mm. We're talking about, what, 2013, bro? Yeah. <laughs> 2013? Like, almost 10 years ago. I mean. Yeah, fuck, almost 10 years ago. A long time ago, dude. They were the only changed. club in the, in the city, though, pretty yeah, much. Yeah, a lot has changed since then. There is a valve. Yeah. There is the Velve. Well, you said it was the only club. The Velve was around. Mm-hmm. No, the Velve was kind of a room. More of a no, room no, no. than a club. Let them let them stick. Yeah. Let Keep going. Sti- well, let me stick what? Keep going. That was a, that was a club. Dude, fight oh, okay. this motherfucker, dog. Yeah, what are you dude. doing? It's a club. People got booked there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now there's a bunch of clubs, mm-hmm. including the Black Rabbit. You should go there June 1st to come check out. It's not called Onslaught. It's called Secret Story. I was like, what's the gayest name I could come up with for a storytelling yeah, I show? I can think of 10 Where gayer at? names than that, dude. At Black the Black Rabbit. Rabbit. Secret what? Story. Is it at Butt Plug City? <laughs> <laughs> Every first Saturday, uh, 10 p.m., storytelling show, Black Rabbit. Are you going to care about this show, though, at all? I don't know. Yeah. What, what is, why are you saying that? Because you had other shows before. You just did not give a fuck about them at all. Who told you I didn't care? I went to the shows, like, multiple times, mm-hmm. and you told me, I don't really care about this. Why would you say that? 
<laughs> Cause it's true. I, I don't remember. I don't recall saying any of that, dude. You did not give and a I fuck, bro. And I appreciate anybody who ever gave me a show. Thank you. I appreciate it. <clears throat> All right. Yeah. Shows have runs, and then shows end. It's okay. Yeah. Why? Because now, s- secret story is that <clears throat> Black Rabbit. It's gonna be good. Uh, I heard you need a stamps because you're always mailing it in. <laughs> <laughs> I have not been. I've been. I've been. I've been practicing my set like I've been like for for funniest person in Austin. No, oh, right. so I've been doing the same fucking set again and again and again. Why? How, why would you do that to yourself? So I can get it right. <clears throat> All right. And then in this, I made the mistake of asking. I was like, hey, I was thinking of saying this for FPIA. And he's like, oh, I wouldn't say none of that. First of all, he talks about his dad's dick, his dick, and his son's dick all in the same fucking, like, 30 seconds. And then at hey, the end, I go, hot, daddy, dude. No. Yeah. It's hot for these fucking crowd, but come on. I mean, I don't know. No, actually, Do- I who talk knows? About four, I talk about four generations. Oh, and your grandpa's dick. So and I talk about. Have you tried it at a Cap City crowd? I, I, I talk about my son. Mine, my dad's, my grandpa's, and my great grandpa. And your generation. great grandpa? You added your great grandpa? Yeah, great grandpa Popo. That's what I say. Oh fuck, Popo. That's right. Yeah, that's five Popo. generations of dicks in one joke. And it's just Damn. like so, like, that's like what, what the what? fuck, dude? Eighteen inches all together? Uh, no, way more, <laughs> more than that. I don't know. It's probably a meter. <laughs> <laughs> a meter. You're dicks. laughing. You're laughing at this, but dude, we gotta help out our friend, bro. I thought you just said I was doing well at the show. I said you were killing it. I said you were doing well. <laughs> <laughs> I do what I do. You're not oh supposed to God, kill, dude. And the first joke is my grandma doing drugs. So, yeah, and that gets a good pop. That's a cute little story, man. But then you take it on to some other shit where like, oh, I'm that's the me. point. You 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 start with them like, ha ha, this is ca- that's cute, and then you take them down and you drag them down like a crocodile into the deep. But it doesn't. It's not deep though. Like I'm just I'm just being an asshole. You are being an asshole. No. Yeah. You're 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 better than your jokes, man. What? You gotta just work on that shit. No. Think about it for a half a, mi- a second longer, and you'll get some no, good, this good is what you do. material. This is, what, this, this is what I do. I take deep something that resonates. Deep, deep situations. You want to be known as a guy that talks about four generations of dicks? Yes, because I take important deep conversations and i make them stupid and i take stupid conversations and i make them important that's how i do my shit so i'll say something right. really stupid it's definition and of insanity i'll fucking right there. i'll be very intricate with it and it'll be seven minutes long it's like why did he dig so long into it's not f- intricate though into foot fucking i say you guys settle this the competition joke off a, a, a comedy competition fpia sure. sign up not gonna sign no, up. it's just going to be a show with, with the two of you. Let's do it. Ten minutes back to back. I do ten minutes, and you do ten minutes, back and I go follow ten back. minutes, and then I do ten minutes, and then you do ten minutes. Yeah. I say we should do it, bro, and put money on it, dog. <laughs> well, I have nothing to prove, but if you All want right. to. Damn. I mean, I don't care. I don't have anything to prove either. I just want to okay. fucking bury you, dog. <laughs> You think you'd bury me? I think so. No. Come on. <laughs> bury okay. me? Yeah. I think no. I, I think I'd oh, shit, I gotta fold emasculate right now. you oh, no, in front of everybody, bro. What am I going to do? Oh, no. No. <laughs> I, think, I think you'd be... I think I think I would... Uh, see, right now we're talking about you already getting amped up. You bury me? Like, you're getting all amped up? <laughs> no, because... I'm I think never, on the actual you, you show, I wouldn't be able to talk to you behind your headphones like... Mm. No, because I, I... No. Because I never... I didn't say I'd bury you. I think I... You don't have to say Remember that. what happened with the arm wrestling thing? No one would believe you. <laughs> That's physical strength. <laughs> physical strength. Emotional strength and physical strength. <laughs> and psychological this strength. Straight right, spirituals from the I'm soul. I'm a triple threat strength. Let's do an emotional strength competition. <laughs> <laughs> to even it out. Oh, I got you beat, bro. I stuff my no. feelings deep down, bro. <laughs> I stuff my feelings deep down, dude. Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah. I, don't, I don't think I'd bury you. I think you'd follow me just the way I would follow you. No. Yeah. Pe- pe- people would notice. No. I have followed you. What are you talking about? Yeah. 
You gone after I me? Fo- I followed you, him. You've gone after me, Edward. What does that mean? Damn, he said you've been on my dick. You love my <laughs> style. <laughs> <laughs> baby got a job. Baby got a job. <laughs> and then you get mad and you try to shit on me on, in front of the crowd. Remember when you did that and the crowd hated you for doing that? What was this? That's funny. It was an Edward show. Edward nice. show. Yeah. I remember. Nice. I remember. They hated your guts. <laughs> No, they liked your set, but then you made fun of me, and then they hated you for it. They're like, well, fuck you. Mm. Yeah, I don't remember that. <laughs> Is it recorded? <laughs> then it never happened. <laughs> <laughs> There's no competition. You know, it, it, everybody has their own lane to pick, but I just, I wish you did, you took a little bit more thought into the shit that you write, man, because you're very uh, philosophical, intuitive. You're very, uh, you know. You got you got the the brains and the capacity, man. But you just you just like doing like uh, this like eight, this teenage fucking thing where it's just talking about dicks, you know, your baby's dick and your grandpa's dick. And, and I call everybody a P Diddy for looking at my baby's dick. It's like, what? <laughs> come on, bro, you're killing me. I and like these stupid people are laughing at I, you. I'm I, like, stop encouraging. I me. enjoy being silly and stupid. Sounds like you're mad that the audience is enjoying. I, I'm themselves. just jealous. Yeah, I'm, I, I figured it out. I'm just jealous of you, bro. <laughs> Why does everything I have to say be so? Oh, it has to be poignant. And I, you have to get this message. Not poignant, from me. but you know, it's, it's not really a message to do yeah. it. But it's just like when that's all you're doing. It's, that's not it's, all I'm doing. It, it gets a it little like, around. like it gets I said, a little nerve wracking. You, you get you you take very serious subjects and you make them what's, stupid. What serious subject? Serious subjects are talking about like things that are real to you, like the my son having Down syndrome. You just say that. I know because it helps me gauge the audience. You no, you just say that, and then they get get pulled back, or they go in, but then you move I mean, on my to my favorite. Is, well, my favorite is no, that's not the. You first don't. Thing you don't. I say. You don't like. You that's don't like th- say the. No. I mean, there's so much stuff that you can talk about no, that's there. That's not the first thing I say. I talk about him not going to college. The first thing I talk about, I talk about is our relationship for the future. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and my favorite is when people go. Uh, uh, when it helps me gauge the audience because when I say it, my favorite response is when they go, "Oh no, nah, bro!" When they do that, that's my favorite. Is your wife laughing at that joke? Yeah, I've gone through all the jokes that I said, hmm. and some of them she was like, "Cut that! That's low hanging fruit." And I was like, "All right." Jesus. But you take a serious subject and then you make it stupid and silly. And then you take something that means absolutely nothing. No, I know what you're saying. The attempt, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just saying. Attempt, I'm just saying you're not, the you're not doing it. Thing the attempt. What? What? <laughs> it's the execution. <laughs> Being able to make that happen. All right, I, just, I, I, just, I just wish the best for you, dude. Because you're a you. good dude, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> I've been having really good sets in Austin. It's been very nice. I just don't like the rumors that I've been spreading about you. <laughs> <laughs> Basically. <laughs> like, you know, Josh saw my wife naked. One <laughs> he's he's not going to deny it. To this day, he will not apologize. He's going to reason with it. He's going to reason with it. It's payback, bro. <laughs> Where do we go from here, man? Was it on purpose? Huh? It wasn't on purpose. What was it on purpose? Seeing his wife in her underwear. His I'm angry, ex-wife. Bro. I'm <laughs> super angry. I don't ex-wife. know why. Ex-wife. Oh, I thought that was just like an exaggeration. Friends. I didn't know that had actually happened. Yeah, she was right there. <laughs> I was right there. What color pants was she wearing? Black. <laughs> it matched. Why'd it. you cut your hands? <laughs> <Both black. laughs> to look at my house. <laughs> Why'd you cup your hands and look at my house, though? What was the point of that? You could I just did, rang a doorbell. I did not cup my hands and look in. She told me you cupped your hands. <laughs> I did not cup my hands and look in. She told me you cupped my hands. You cupped your hands. <laughs> no way. I heard her yell. <laughs> I heard, I I heard her fuck. yell, too. I almost ran away. I almost ran away. I was like, ah, oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Josh, you would have been gunned down you? by the police? Josh, yeah, I could see him in the back. Josh was watching. I could see him in the back, and I keep calling him. And then she came out, and I was like, oh, shit. <coughs> it's only right. You got to make it right. You got to let him wa- <laughs> see your wife. That's not equal. 
No, it's time. He'd have to. His wife would have to see me in my time, underwear. Time his is. His ex-wife uh, would have to see me in my underwear. The time is gone. Time, I can't ever get that time back, dude. <laughs> There's no equal. There's no such thing as being equal. Was what? Took something okay, from you. let me ask you this: Was what I did? What I did was that malicious? Did I do it on purpose? Yeah, it, when you cupped your hands, yeah. <laughs> you were looking for something, and you saw it. <laughs> what What happened when I when I saw? What What did I do? I don't know. You said you wanted to run away. Yeah, that means you were guilty, dude. <laughs> your first thought was to leave the scene of a crime. Okay. Yeah, that means you're a yeah, fucking yeah. criminal. Dude. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing I can do. That would happen to you too. Some heinous crime gets committed, and you just run, oh. and it all gets pinned on you. Yeah, the, the fucking run uh, away without even moving my arms. Just <laughs> the underbite I'm going. That's what I think you think I did. Every day. Every day, I look Every at that door, day. thinking I'm gonna see you going like this, being a predator. <clears throat> I wouldn't have done that to you. God, I hope you went FBI, bro. I, w- I wouldn't. Have, I wouldn't have ever done that. What? You better I choose your worst, bro. Dude. Come on, man. You better choose your best set. You better not be like trying to make a statement. Well, what did I do that's worse? <clears throat> huh? What did I do that's worse? No, man. I I I couldn't even tell you because I know you've done it behind my back. <laughs> <laughs> I can only think of one thing. You that can't was, even give me an honest opinion I could, either. I, 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 there was only one thing I could ever think of that was worse than that. What was that? When you got that Jeep. Mm-hmm. It's brand new. Mm-hmm. Brand new. He's oh, super, and you scratched the fuck out I of it? scratched it. it. Yeah, I took, for no I, reason either. I took, I took uh, we had some no reason at metal all. piping that, that and, my, and my son was in the back. I didn't want him to scratch anything. I was like, give it to me. I'll hold it so you don't scratch mm-hmm. anything. And when we exited the truck. The bottom of it touched the bottom of it. Yeah. A long stretch like, like that. And I was like, <laughs> fuck. I just got it, bro. I fuck. just got like two days ago. Like, two And then days. his response, anybody else? Bro, anybody else, bro? <laughs> <laughs> but I could feel for like a week just the heat. like Pissed, like, dude. Because <laughs> I know he's driving me like. You can see it. Yeah. <laughs> I felt so bad. I felt so bad. That had been a stranger doing that to my car. I'm pulling my pistol out, bro. <laughs> Damage my property. Now I felt I got, so bad, dude. You, oh, didn't give, you didn't feel bad enough I mean, to be like, hey, I'll, have, I'll, right? I'll pay you 200 bucks. <laughs> that was worse, I think. God damn it, dude. Window shopper. Uh, you know what's worse, too, is every time I, I pull up. I'm not trying to stun on anybody, bro. You know what I mean? But I, I pull up. And I'm like, oh, yeah, what is that? He's like, hang on. Let me get my family. And every all the kids, what? Get out of here! This is not yours. Like it's always like this is not yours. I was like, what? what are you talking about? I make money. This is like gay. Yeah, you're so gay. I pulled up with the with fuck, your red Camaro. I pulled up with top down, stunning, bro. <laughs> Just got it wax. It was fucking nice. He made a response. The whole like, his whole family comes out, and Mercer's like gay. <laughs> I was like, what, dude? Get, stop. <laughs> She's like, hey, could you not rev your engine when you come by my house? I'm like, that's just how it is. It's flow masters, bro. I can't help it. She told Josh, he's like, hey, don't do that around my house, bro. She gets pissed. <laughs> Literally starting the car. Remember how? Yeah. Shit was nice, dude. Yeah, the kids did like it, though. Yeah. The children? Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, my buddy, uh, when he got it's married, he asked me to... Yeah. Drive him to uh, drive him away from the. I mean, this is after open bar. I was all fucking smashed and shit, bro. He's like, "Oh, bro, put your top down. We're gonna, can you drive us to the hotel or whatever the fuck?" I was like, "Yeah, whatever." Dude. So pulling away, <laughs> pulling away. I'm all fucking like, <laughs> trying to drive all fucking wide out. <laughs> fucking, I'm going down this long ass, dark ass driveway and shit because we're pulling away from the wedding venue. <laughs> And the top's down. I, I fucking hit it, bro. I was like going 80 miles down this fucking oh, road. Fuck, like dude. top down. He's like, hey, hey, bro. Hey, bro. Slow down. I was like, what's up? He's like, and I, I look back and his wife with a big white gown is all fucked up. Or the, you know, the <laughs> veil flew off and shit. He's like, could you put your top up, bro? It's kind of fucked up. <laughs> I was like, yeah, dude. We're on the highway. All the top's down. I'm fucking having a good time. He's like, hey, bro, could you put your top up real quick, bro? It's like freezing back here and shit. My my wife's hair is all fucked up. I was like, yeah, hold on a second. 
I can't believe it almost flew off with this guy. Yeah, I almost Mary Poppins myself. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I did that. I thought no, he was flexing. No reason why. I, 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 I guess I want to see what was going to happen. <laughs> that would have fucked up. That actually fucked up my uh, my uh, top. You didn't slow down? I thought you were going to see your I bicep. Did. Yeah, I fucked up my bicep too. I, I, I think I tore something on my on my shoulder. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Yeah, you're basically yeah, you're basically hitting a parachute like. Boom. I had to keep on my top for like three months after that because it was the the back was all bent for me holding it down like crazy. <laughs> and then uh, I had to go get it replaced and shit. That shit cost a lot of fucking money. Fuck, dude. I've, I've had the, I've had the vehicles. I was like, okay, I had it, and I'll have I'll never have one of these ever again. You know. Is it Jeep like that? No, I'm going to keep this fucking bitch forever. I would get an, another Jeep, but I just, you got to know the ins and outs of it, you know. Was the Camaro like a gas guzzler for sure? Uh, V8. Actually, I get fucking better mileage on the then fucking, uh, no, I get worse bonds on this thing. That's what I'm saying. Thing. You get yeah, better on the Camaro. the tires and shit. Was oh, no. that nine miles to the gallon? No, it's like 15, 16 miles no a gallon. No way. Shit. Yeah. I'm supposed to get like 19 or 20, but... Tires. That's rough. What's the one thing that you said? Fuck it, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna have it. I'm gonna just take it, you know, or I'm gonna buy it, or I'm gonna fuck, you know. What's a business. the one thing? That's one thing you had. A yeah. business. A business. Mm. Didn't have the money to do it, and I did it anyway. Mm. Yeah. Baby. Oh, I did a bit. Yeah, babies too. <laughs> Baby. Babies. Oh, you just said fuck it, I'm doing it. Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> I was very methodical with all my kids. All of them. No. No. I think, no. I think about that three, and now I'm, I'm done. Like I know in my head, I'm not gonna have any more kids. No, you are. You haven't been snipped. I'm not. Yeah, but I'm not gonna impregnate another woman. I don't know. You're fucking around a lot, dude. I'm not fucking around at all. <clears throat> why would you say that? So you're not gonna get snipped? No. Why would I get snipped? It's because. I, I mean. Why not? Do your part. You kind of no. fuck. Putting spare uh, new to your husbands, Marissa's offspring at uh, at risk for having to split their inheritance with other. This is true. No, no, she other she, kids. She can't have babies at all, dude. Someone could drug no, but you. You can have them with other people. Someone yeah, could drug gonna... you, jerk you off, spit the cum inside their own puss, and then that's the only way it could happen. Would you right? do it? <laughs> would somebody do that? I'm just saying it could happen. I've seen stranger things have happened. No, I don't. No. Someone could take it from you. I mean, What's the I'll, one thing I'll, that you I'll try said? Try to fight him. Oh, fuck! I just gotta have it. I'm gonna do it. Impulse or whatever. Yeah, money or whatever. The baby, really? <laughs> fuck! You guys, you guys play, play for keeps, dude. <laughs> yeah. I mean, what do you think of my Timex watch? <laughs> <laughs> that is a lot of money. A baby is a lot of money. Yep. No, it just, just somehow it just comes into your budget out of nowhere, right? Am I crazy or you what? find the money? No, it's, it will. The money, yeah, yeah it yeah. just finds you. It's, it's fucking crazy, you know? It's crazy, dude. I don't know how the fuck it happens, but you're like, oh, I could afford another person this whole time? Holy shit. <laughs> the fuck am I spending my money on you? All these video games and shit. Fuck. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's what happens. You just don't play video games or, yeah. or feed your dog healthy food or... You, know yeah. you realize <laughs> that's a dog, bro. You know, yeah. you realize like, oh, they don't matter at all. You know, yeah, they do not matter. When you look at your baby's eyes, you look at your dog's eyes. You're like, I'm gonna shoot that dog between the fucking eyes. I hate know? that my dog doesn't do magical shit like like get next to her belly and like look look at it longingly like I see in these like TikTok she, videos. She doesn't know what is what does the dog do. It just uh, eats its own ass or just. <laughs> just looks away like doesn't give a fuck <laughs> there's no emotional uh, attachment with that dog like yo y'all the dog thinks he owns y'all like yeah they feed me i get the fuck when i want or whatever you know what i mean <laughs> Here, no she's just started. not magical she's a she's a predator though oh, she already oh, killed yeah. two skunks last week mm. she killed a skunk and then it was like you gotta stay outside that's right uh, yeah no <clears throat> well she bit into it and killed it, so mm. that's automatically going to leave a smell. So we decided, like, all right, you got to stay outside. Mm-hmm. She killed another one that uh, that same night, the next oh, night. Oh, shit. Shit. The mom skunk came over. I was like, oh, shit. And fucking your vicious she dog killed it. Up, man. She's a, 
He's a crazy Damn. animal. He loves humans, but little little animals, she wants to kill it. Kill all of them. I, I blame the squirrels now. I mean, enough dead squirrels back there. You figure they'd stop fucking with Bruno, you know? Oh, yeah. But Bruno's are like, I'll take on your whole fucking family. <laughs> like, <laughs> I think they, like, killed Bruno's wife or something, bro. He's like the <laughs> punisher with these fucking the squirrels, punisher. dude. He is. Yeah, I've seen him snap necks. Like, he grabs him and goes, and fucking... <laughs> I saw him rip one in half with his like and like that. Just, God, and the blood was over him. And he fucking spit the blood, and the other ones were like, "Oh shit!" Now that happened in uh, Kong, actually. <laughs> it's in him. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a trip. I took him to the new house, and he was like, "Okay, so are we living here or what?" And I was like, "Yeah, you'll be back here." He was like, <laughs> <laughs> "The bigger yard, from." Yeah, a bigger yard. I don't have a fence. A back. I don't have. I have one side of the fence. That's the only fence that I own. All the rest is like from other houses and shit. I got five neighbors in my backyard. Yeah, it's crazy. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. It's all like you got one of those weird. He's like yeah. Surrounded. 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 Yeah. This the neighbor guy came today. He's the most, me and Veronica and I are not people, bro. We're not people. People, you know. Is we're in our garage. I'm, I'm, we're putting up curtains. I got a, I, I did some shit at the house, and the neighbor across the street was like, "Are those my new neighbors?" And he's like, "In my driveway already." I'm like, and we both look up like two prairie dogs. We're like, <laughs> he walks all the way and t- on my shit, bro. Like, stay from the street. Hey, how you doing? Hey, hey, you know something friendly. He's that my new neighbors, and he comes over and he looks like a fucking like a leprechaun, Neanderthal and shit. And he's just like, uh, what's up, bro? Yeah. I'm like, what's up, dude? And we're both like, hey, what's going on? And the guy, he's like, yeah, all right. We're like, anything else? And he goes, oh, yeah, no, it's, it's going to say hi, I guess. And we're just like, damn. Okay. Man, you guys are assholes. Yeah. No, we're not assholes. It's just, she doesn't chit chat. I don't chit chat. Yeah, we're, we're, we're not the neighbors to chit chat with, bro. You know. I think you're better than him. And you're coming over empty handed. Fucking, we're new neighbors. Bring on, bring something over. Well, you bro. know that those people in those neighborhoods. That's how they act with each no, other. No, no, no. Like, they have to nice like. Neighborhood. They have to know what's going on. He's just saying hi to his new neighbor. He's gonna live next to you. No, he's not. He's across the street. For God's sake, he's not even living next to him. What I see him do too. You tell him to grab a box. Grab a box. Yeah, grab something. He's like, hey, can you help me with that? They'll Fuck like, no! I don't want to invite him in my bit. house. I don't want anybody to think it's cool to come over to my house when I'm not there. Why would they come over when you're not there? I don't know. People are fucking weird like that. I mean, people they came are over like while you were there, though. You can be nice to. Yeah, people. but I don't want people to think that we're nice at all, though. I want them to be like, oh, those people just they, they do their own thing. They're you standoffish. Want, you want people to? You want? Do you live around these people? Why? Why be nice? Yeah. Why? You know they're looking uh, out out the, the blinds, going like hmm, new money. World ends, those are the first people I'm robbing, I'm shooting. I'm not going to be friendly with them, bro. If you start naming people, that means you're attached to them. Honey, that new money's leaving. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So when you plan on moving in, I was like, as so soon as you, possible. If dude. you don't know, they're just inanimate objects. Hmm? If you don't know, they're just inanimate objects. The apocalypse ends, I won't have any problem putting that trigger, bro. I'm telling you, dude. I won't have, oh, Mrs. Mrs. Girdle across. Mrs. Girdle's dead, bro, because I know she has a stockpile of gold, some old newspapers we could burn. <laughs> uh, I mean, the strategy of taking what you want from people has worked so far. This is true. Yeah. You got to take what you want. You got to be a taker or a giver, bro. Yeah. Straight up. This world's hard on you, dude. Sometimes the world will say no, but they really mean try harder. <laughs> Sometimes the world will say no, but they really mean is. Uh, please stop. <laughs> and that's when you gotta pull your hair and bite that fucking world's cheek and shut the fuck up, bitch. Get, you, get on your fucking knees. <laughs> please do. Shut the fuck up. Got any shows coming up? I just feel like people need to try harder, man. This world of like politeness is like for the birds, dude. Be better and be more. Be less. Be less in my yard. You know. Like, respect my boundaries, dude. You know what I'm saying? Just be out there. Hey, how you do? Hey, I'm sorry to bother you, man. I, 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 that's why I treat you. Hey, dude, sorry to bother I'm just your neighbor across the street. Just saying hi. Just saying, like, like I, I, I know you guys are busy. I'm not going to come over here and expect you to chit-chat with me. You know what I mean? Have you ever thought that maybe it's because <sighs> at work you have to be so, like, careful oh, with people? Yeah. Right? 
that when you're off the clock, you just don't want to have to. You're a submissive aco- at work. Ac- accommodate accommodate you're people's su- feelings. You're and submissive at no. work, so when you get off of work, you want to be the dom. Not at all. Not at all. <laughs> so, like, I'm funny, right? We're all funny. But are you telling jokes when you're not at work? No, right? You're not fucking like right. hanging out just telling jokes. No, that's just not what you do, right? So when I'm you at work, you leave the heart at work where it belongs. No, I don't leave the heart, but I work. I'm, I do what I'm supposed to do. But outside of work, I don't owe anybody anything. I don't fucking owe anybody anything. So we have to meet halfway. I don't have to do ninety and then you do ten. You know, I let's meet halfway. You know, is there Amy? something that, that that the neighbor could have done to like ingratiate himself Stopped to you at my driveway? <laughs> Stopped at my driveway and go, hey, I'm just across the street, man. Just saying hi real quick. Now just keep it moving, keep it passing. Hey, I'm Nate. Whatever, and then it's up to me. Go, oh, hey, all right, thanks, brother. I'm like, oh, hang on a second, and keep me. Let me walk out. Don't walk all the way up in my fucking in my shit and be like, oh, I'm I'm putting up a fence. To, in, in the front? front? Yes, Are I'm you putting allowed? up a fuck. Yeah, I don't oh, know. Neighborhoods don't let you. Yeah, that's a no, weird. no, I, I I didn't pay into that shit. Man, so this one won't let. That's you. gonna look weird. This one will let me. No, it won't. Yes, it will. You can't box off the front right there. They can't be like a full giant fence, but I can do like a two foot fence. And if he hops <laughs> over, I got the right to shoot. Not right. <laughs> Pussy no, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make like a fence. little like a little toddler fence, like a little white picket fence. That way, people actually have to. That people will not step over it to fucking. If they do, it, I'd be, hey man, get the fuck out of here. You know, I have a right <laughs> to say that shit. No soliciting, no polite neighbors. You want it to look as uninviting as, to step forward? <laughs> yes, dude. It's not. We're not friendly. Don't come at. Don't come at me with nothing. Why don't you put those World War Two dragon teeth? Yeah, put some. I almost want to put some fucking uh, Nazi schnarren. <laughs> We no, saw those we pigeon saw, spikes. We saw a Trump flag, and I was like, "Oh, thank God, dude! <laughs> Jesus Christ!" We saw one, and I was like, "Oh my God, a Trump flag!" I'm like, "Why do you, she get so bent out of shape? Do you get bent out of shape if you see like shit going on? Does your girl no. get bent out of shape now?" Oh, I, I used to with the the huh? Be- Beto, po- the Beto one. <laughs> really? That's the only ones I ever got. Like you fucking idiot. <laughs> see, I, I I treat that shit like okay, they're a uh, San Francisco 49ers fan. And yeah. they're representing their team. Oh, yeah, right, I have yeah. no problem with gives a fuck. Biden or any of the other yeah. Trump or whoever, what, put yeah. whatever you want. The we, Seahawks uh, jersey. If you don't have <laughs> Trump flags in your neighborhood, are, do you even live in a good neighborhood? <laughs> <clears throat> no, fucking, uh, she saw a Trump flag. She's like, oh, my God. I was like, why does that fucking bother you? Like, what the fuck is your problem, you know? It's just, like, so stupid. Why do they want everybody to know about it? I'm like, Cause they're Cowboys fans. We're gonna have a Cowboys, Cowboys flag over here. Ooh. What the fuck? You know what I got in in the neighborhood that uh, I hadn't seen in our neighborhood? A lot of uh, Black Lives Matter signs. Oh my god, that's the worst. <laughs> that Wait, is the absolute you, you, worst. You had them? No, in the new neighborhood I'm moving into in Austin. Oh, it's oh, BLM yeah, I see what you mean. yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. That's not an organization that you can join. You just you just support the movement. You can't join that organization. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> Because you tried, <laughs> I did. I tried to join, but you can't join. You just got to give them money. Need ten thousand dollars. Yeah. Uh, when do we meet? Yeah. Oh, there's no. no sir, me- it's all right. Uh, you just send us the money. Yeah. No, I know, no, but I want to meet you. <laughs> there's no agenda. Like, okay, well, what are we doing? Is it who? Who are we helping? Like, can we help somebody? You know, there's not. There's not. There's none of that going on. We're helping the lives that matter. Hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know. It's just it's, <clears throat> when you start to really open your eyes, man. I don't know. The cops came into the house too. Oh yeah, he broke into his own house. The fucking yeah, my it has an alarm system, and I don't know the code. The owner, last owners didn't leave the code, so it's wait, wait, wait. It says the back door is you know being broken, and the thing talks to you and shit. <laughs> oh my god, there's people in the house, and I'm just like what the fuck? And I ripped it off the wall, and it's still going. Nice try, you bastard. I'm just like, what the <laughs> fuck? So I didn't hit the speaker and shit, but that also sends an alert to the cops like, I'm being tampered with. <laughs> fucking two fucking uh, SUVs pull up, like six cops jump out of that shit. <laughs> I guess they're right in the backseat, you know? <laughs> they come out and they're all like, fucking, you see them all around my fucking uh, my house and shit. I'm all like doing shit illegally, right? And so <laughs> I, I go outside. I'm like, what's going on, officers? They're like, Oh, hey, what's up? Uh, do you live here? I was like, I don't know. What? <laughs> you have an ID? I was you know, like, I shoes. don't have an ID. <laughs> They're like, and you see the guy like, okay, dude. And he pulls out his shit. He's like, what's your name? I was like, why? 
Did I commit a crime? Am I being detained? <laughs> All right, well. If I'm not being detained, then I, I my uh, Fourth Amendment's being violated right now. <clears throat> I'm looking at their. I'm not even talking. I'm talking to their body cams and shit. <laughs> No, they were like, hey, so this, this, and that. And I was like, oh, yeah, dude, fucking, the, the, I broke it. <laughs> I couldn't know the code. I writ- Look, I got holes in Can y'all come help me? Like, mm-hmm. fuck, dude, I need to break down this wall. They were like, ha, 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 We'll fucking put it in our system. We have to show up every time it goes off. They were like, cut the alarm inside, bro. And I was like, can, what? He's like, we can't really tell you that. But cut the fucking alarm inside so we don't got to keep coming out here. I was like, can you show me where it is? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's the that was the first day. So all my neighbors are outside. They're all looking. I got like six cop cars at the oh, house no. and shit. I'm all like fucking, and then I, I can mean. see them. They're just like these fucking Mexicans coming in the neighborhood. And you're mean to the other neighbor. Yeah, I think he's a cop. Who's though. lived there for thirty years? No, no, I, I think he's a cop. He has all these trucks in his yard, but I only ever see him. So I'm like, is this guy gay? What the fuck? I haven't even been here for a week, and they're already in trouble. <laughs> Help, police! They're trying to arrest me. Yeah. Anyway. Well, what shows you got coming up? I don't know, dude. Go to George Anthony Comedy on Instagram. And follow the uh, Puto Face crew on TikTok. That shit's fucking great, man. Yep. Yep. Bro? I got anything. All of these nuts. Boom. Uh, this Sunday, come to Laugh Out Loud. I'll be headlining there. Check it out. And June 1st and every first Saturday of the month, it will be uh, Secret Story at Black Rabbit.